Hey, how's it going, everybody? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com, and welcome to the update for Saturday, October 17th, 2020. Free pick coming up. Another college football game, our second free pick video in college football this weekend. We'll get to that in just a moment. Hey, if you've yet to become a member at DocSports.com, just want to give it a trial run, click on that link below the video, get set up for a free $60 account, which you can then use on any of my daily packages over at DocSports.com. It is as simple as that. Again, you get started by clicking on that link below the video, free $60 account to give Doc Sports trial run. You can use it on those daily packages. All right, uh, we're red hot right now with our premium picks. We're going to head into Saturday, having gone 6-0 and on Thursday and Friday in baseball, golf, and soccer. Perfect 6-0 and sweep the last two days. Uh, we cashed again a six-star play in baseball yesterday. That was the over in the battle between the Astros and the Rays. And I wanted to mention that right now, Heading into the weekend, we are 10 and 3 with our last 13 baseball plays rated five stars or higher, up over $4,200 for $100 per unit betters. I've got another high-end play uh, going on Saturday's card. You can grab that on my Handicappers homepage at DocSports.com. Uh, PGA, we're 3-0 so far in the CJ Cup here in Las Vegas at Shadow Creek. 26-13 is now the golf run going back to the 1st of August, up over $4,300 for $100 per unit buyers, uh, betters, I should say. And as far as football, uh, kind of a bummer because the seven-star was postponed. Man, we made it through the week. We go into Thursday. We post the plays on Thursday afternoon and then on Friday afternoon we find out that the game that happens to be postponed on Friday due to positive COVID test happens to be our seven star play. We had Southern Miss over UTEP. Uh, we still liked it at six, six and a half Southern Miss. Thought they'd win by at least 10 in that particular football game. Unfortunately, it's no longer part of the package. We still have three football plays on Saturday in college football. We've got four NFL plays for this week, which includes the six star play, top play of the weekend now uh, in football is my six star play in the NFL. So again, all seven plays still available and my top rated plays college football football and NFL, my high-end plays, 60% with our last 99. So you can still jump on board, get all seven plays Saturday and Sunday and a game on Monday. So there you go, including that six-star in the NFL. So we got a lot going on. Also, UFC, 4-0 the last four weeks, all were rated six stars. We've got a six-star going in UFC action on Saturday night's card. You're going to like this price again. Uh, we've been red hot in UFC, red hot in golf, red hot in baseball, and they're all three going to be in action on Saturday. Saturday, led by that uh, six-star play on the bases. All right, seven plays, football still to go. Six-star play baseball. We've also got soccer. Uh, we have two plays. We've got an afternoon play on Saturday in soccer action, and I've got an early morning English Premier play. Uh, for Sunday's action in both plays, Saturday and Sunday, on the same report. So you'll be able to grab them both. All right, so still plenty to go. Uh, we'll look to stay perfect on Saturday. 6-0 and again, the last two days, soccer, baseball, and PGA. Let's jump into our play, and I'm bringing up the lines here. i got about 18 books in front, and we want to make sure that uh, we're giving you the actual line of where it sits right now. And in most books, uh, the team that we're on, Texas State, getting three and a half. Uh, in this particular game from South Alabama. This is a 12 noon kickoff, by the way, 12 noon Eastern time. And uh, listen, I look back to that Southern Miss game with South Alabama. We actually, I think we had a free pick, free video pick on South Alabama that one. And it was a situation where the Jags were going up against a team with a coach on a hot seat and then some. He lost his job after losing to South Alabama and he was a coach that wasn't very popular among the players and the seat was as hot as it gets before the season even began. Uh, so that's kind of a so-so way now at this point for South Alabama. Uh, they didn't play well in the second half against Tulane. They got just clocked by UAB last time out. As far as Texas State is concerned, been impressed with them despite, despite the fact they're one and four straight up. Going all the way back to that opening weekend loss to SMU when Texas State was using a quarterback who was way down on the depth chart, still came within seven of beating SMU. They've had a couple of close calls. They played BC uh, right to the wire, losing that game by three points. I like him here to pull the upset. So we're going to recommend a play, a pick on uh, Texas State plus the points over South Alabama 12 noon Eastern time on Saturday. That's our free pick. Don't forget seven plays to go. College football in the NFL. The six-star play in the NFL still remains. 
and uh, we'll look to uh, make it 60% uh, winner still with 100 plays. Our last 100 top plays, college football and NFL combined. Golf, soccer, it's all available on Saturday on my Handicappers homepage over at DocSports.com. If you like the videos, click on the thumbs up button and be sure to subscribe. Also wanted to mention I will be back here Saturday night, NFL free picks for Sunday's card. Let's put Saturday in the win column. We'll talk to you then.